On May 17, 1968, nine Catholic activists raided the Selective Service Office in Catonsville, in the building right there, second floor of the building, burned several hundred draft files to protest the Vietnam War. In a highly publicized trial, the nine, who included Priest Daniel and Philip Berrigan, we're also including the full nine, seven names here, David Darst, John Hogan, represented by his wife Joan. Tom Lewis, also of the four, Baltimore Four. Margarita Melville, one of the two surviving members of the George Mishy, also surviving in Minnesota. And Mary Moylan. Yes, and Mary Moylan completed the nine, were convicted and sentenced to prison. The Catonsville action played an important role in the anti-war movement, inspiring similar acts of civil disobedience across the country. Officially marked here by Maryland Historical Trust, Maryland State Highway Administration. Bye. Back up, and we're going to have some uh, short comments now. Comments from action, uh, this action and other me members of subsequent actions will give some brief reflections back up in our seating area. That's my question. Which Amy Goodman do you propose to watch? Five AM and W B A. Oh yeah. <laughs> we watch W A T. Did you feel fear? So that's at night. Yeah, eight o'clock I think, isn't it? No, I think it's eleven. No. Ten. Oh, she's right. Because I'm not always awake. <laughs> But um, they were passing around an email list where you can get a 